Hello everybody, I'm Master Ruffles, and it's time to play Dawn of War Soulstorm using the Ultimate Apocalypse mod. So for today's video, we're going to be playing as the Tyranids, and we're going to be versing off against the Sisters of Battle on Hain's Demise, a fairly large map. The Sisters of Battle are a faction that I wish there was a little bit more lore on, but unfortunately, there's no lore on them whatsoever. They're just very, very little compared to, like, the Imperium of Man. In fact, a lot of the Xenos are kind of like that, to be honest. It does kind of suck. So if there was like a little bit more Xenos books about and maybe some lore on, I don't know, the lesser known chapters of the Space Marines, I would definitely buy those Warhammer books in an instant. But oh well. Oh well. You can't you can't get everything you want. And unfortunately since Dawn of War 3 isn't coming out anytime soon and I'm not really into the tabletop version of Warhammer 40k, I have to really settle for books and uh this which is all around pretty good, but, you know, I would really like some more variety, I guess, with my Warhammer lore. Okay, so what do the Turnits have to wor uh, have to not worry about that the other factions do have to worry about? Well, they don't have to worry about, uh, what was it, power so much in terms of, you know, building units and researching tech and constructing buildings. None of their buildings, units, or tech actually requires power at all. However, what does require power are their hive mind powers. And they cost a lot of power, but they can change the entire face of a battlefield. Look at this, planetary bombardment. Unleash hundreds of Tyranid infested meteors at a designated target. That is incredible. So, power is needed for those abilities. But requisition can pretty much be used for everything, for building units, for constructing buildings, for researching tech, for upgrading your hive mind, I think. Hold on a second, let me... Check that out. No, you do actually need power to upgrade the hive mind. You also can use power to build extra units like Hormagons, Termagons, Spine Gaunts, Ripper Swarms. If you do need a little bit more units here and there for a quick little save. But for the most part, you can build most of your units from the buildings that, and they require a little bit of uh, some requisition here and there. But if you do find yourself in a position where, oh, you have a ton of power, but not a lot of uh of requisition you can build units it's cool but like the turns are pretty damn flexible in that regard all right let's try to get out this upgrade really really fast because that will allow us to get us some really awesome troops and now let's also build some lifter alphas and continue getting these spine columns actually are they called spine columns no they're spore chimneys will allow me to actually get a little bit more acquisition, which is awesome. And we get power from the reclamation pools. Alright, come on, Lictor. Lictor units, go! Go! Lictors, I think, in... Oh, what is this guy doing? Lictors, I think, in Dawn of War 2 are actually the... Commander unit. Which is really weird to see them as a regular unit in Dawn of War 1. Then again, a lot of units are kind of like that in Dawn of War 1. Alright then, let's see now. Spine Gaunt, Meat Shield Distraction, Termagaunt, Basic Ranged, and Hormagaunt, Basic Melee. Let's go ahead and take back this point from the Savage Humans. And the Lictors can just go into Invis Mode and harass a little bit. Stop the Sisters of Battle from being a little bit too powerful. Huh. That's weird. Alright, stabby, stabby. There we go. Oh, hello there, friend Renos. I wanted to say hello, but it seems like you want to just try to kill me. I said, I don't like that. I don't like that one, man. So I'm going to have to ask you to stop. Oh crap. Fire burns, fire burns. Okay, I'm gonna send out some gargoyle swarms over to deal with that area over there. Come on, man, come on. Gargoyles, it's up to you. You laid into my trap. 
Well, it wasn't much of a trap, actually. Where are the rest of the gargoyle units? Do you guys really get trapped in those areas? God damn it. Fucking gargoyles. Messing us up all the time. Who do they think they are? Alright, come on, fire upon them. We need some more. We need a high tyrant, actually. I was gonna say more Hormagons, but no, no, no. High tyrant would be better. Huh? You guys wanna mess? Hmm? Hmm? You can't deal with the swarm! Go, 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 go. There we go. Okay. Good god, the sisters of battle are getting framed or cropped. Unfortunately, whenever we get into these hills over here, we get completely swamped. Plus by the path fighting. Alright, let's back off. No, 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 actually, let's continue. So what you get? Try and deal a blow to the Eternate forces. Let's go ahead and get out of Carnifex chamber. Do we have the high tyrant? Yes, we do. Awesome. Bring them forward. Also, continuing to attack the battle sisters. Now we're automatically reinforcing with our gargoyles, so we're just like pelting them to smithereens. Ah, oh, deal with this. This is a battle. Oh, look at your outfits over here chilling about. Now let's go ahead and continue killing. Killing all the battle sisters. Now we can finally regroup all of our gargoyles. Form up into one cohesive hole. Hmm, maybe this can work? For our interest? Oh, hello there, battle sisters. Oh my god. Okay, never mind. Back off, back off. Party time's over. Party time's over. Party time's over. That one grenade. Was able to annihilate most of my battle sisters. Well, not my battle sisters, but most of my health of my uh, gargoyles, which ain't exactly good. Okay, Alpha, please. Go ahead, Miz. Manufactorum, fortified structure. Alright. Oh, remember that? I think the gargoyles get stuck in this cover, though. And I would love to upgrade the Hive Tyrants with some Barbed Stranglers and Venom Cannons, but unfortunately we need to waste a lot of requisition in order to do so. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and get out another Reclamation Pool. Just so that we have a little bit more abilities. Spine gone to without number. Damn. We can get a ton of these spine bombs. Absolutely wonderful. It's like Christmas with the Franks. Alright, Magna Chamber, go. As long as we balance our resources, we should be fine. Granted, we gotta make sure that we don't die by one grenade launcher. Wonder, can we kill this thing? Maybe, uh... If he doesn't send in any units. But he's probably gonna send in units. Yep, there they come. This is a newly formed battle sisters unit. That one is the one with the grenade launcher. Nope! Oh crap, it's too late. Oh, we didn't 
lose that many units, so that's good. Alright, let me get you sports strike really quick. And all of y'all motherfuckers. Crap. Gargoyles are stuck yet again. I love how I can automatically reinforce my warriors. I like so. Now this is what I wanted. It's some good old fashioned artillery. I'm not gonna make enough for requisition points to actually get requisition income too because we're reinforcing so fast. Now with some artillery, I can take out that listening post over there. Ah, finally, now we can get some requisition income. And let's see, can I build more units? Some basic units, but not too many. Alright, come on. I need you to go in hot. Keep focus fire on the tank. There we go. Some sentinels would be pretty bad. Ah, oh, fuck. High Tyrant died. Well, we're taking out his unit, so that's good. Let's go ahead and get a Screamer Killer out. Uh, Screamer Killer, uh, what was it? Carnifex? Yeah, Screamer Killer Carnifex. That's what it's called. Back off the gargoyles a little bit. And now we can move them back forward once again. Ah. Pathetic humans. Taste my bomb stranglers. Zap zap. Zap zap zap. Okay, let's see. How's our power doing? Pretty shit, but we have a... Uh, a lot of power, but our records should, uh, points. Same thing, I guess, pretty shit. But, but, could get a magnum chamber right over here. Since the listening post is basically all gone at this point. Fuck, I would like to diversify the amount of units I could build. Fuck diversification. Spam more shit. Okay, back off that Carnifex for a second. Let me go ahead and use this. Bam, there goes your tank, sucker. Now, come on, continue the pelting, continue the pelting. The warriors, they really do need to have like constant upgrades in the form of, you know, building them some extra weapons and stuff. Because they start off with absolutely nothing. Contacts are also pretty weak. But that's okay, that will change. These two shall change. Let's get Carnifex upgrade for 
healing and then extended carapace. Good. Get some more warrior brutes as well as some, some gaunts actually. Yeah, some spine gaunts would be pretty good. But just as a distraction unit, not really as a mainline infantry force. I guess if they are a meat shield, then they are a mainline infantry force. Can you guys go ahead and build me another gaunt hive, actually? I feel like we're gonna need one. Yeah, we're completely trashing these dudes. I guess gal. I, I, I mean gals, actually. Crushing these gals. Taste my artillery! Look at these big battle boys. My warrior broods. Screamer killer Carnifex and these cargoes over here, which. carrying little pistols. Like John Rambo. Of the Turn It Army. Alright then, spawn gaunts. Go ahead and auto reinforce. I will allow it for now. Well, we could get a zone trope. That would be pretty good. Now let's get some zone tropes up in here. Get some hive tyrants. Ooh, tunnel warrants. Actually, that is probably the best thing we could get because that will allow us to catapult in terms of uh, using some really powerful units. Come at us, come at us, watch. Watch what happens. Oh wait, you guys don't have any upgrades. Nope. Back you off. Okay, spine gone, y'all ready? Y'all ready for this? I love how the gargoyles are keeping them all back. Okay, we are so close to actually sending in our spine gaunts right about now. I do just want to make sure that everything's a okay for attack. Spine gaunt went up number. That's hilarious. Just like, ah, let's just send them in. Okay, get some reclamation pool upgrades. Get some gaunt upgrades. Warrior brood. I thought I got a tunnel warrant. Well, I guess we'll get it next time. Either way, artillery is doing pretty good. All right, then spy gone. So you ready? Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. I need to upgrade my my warriors with some tech, some barb stranglers, some warrior bioplasma. Because remember, if you don't have any uh. Weapons for your warrior brutes, they won't fire. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't mess with my gargoyles, sir. Listen, you're messing with my gargoyles, and I don't like that. Alright guys, you ready? Move forward! Move! Move! Charge forward, spine guns! Go! Go! It is your divine retribution upon humanity! We got more zone probes. Let's get a ton of warrens. Charge, mine guns, charge! We have too many of them! This is incredible! It's a horde! It's a fucking horde. Oh, 
gonna go ahead and use some abilities. Completely trounce the humans. Keep on at it, men. Keep on at it. Fire your barb stranglers and fire your bioplasma. Put his own tropes. Hey, can you go take that guy out? Actually, can you just go ahead and fire? Hey, go ahead and fire. Thank you. Too many spine bombs. I love it. Let's see a ton of worms for a second. Could get a trigon, that's pretty good. Holy fuck! Where did that thing come from? Why the hell is Jesus in this game? Oh no. Focus fire on Jesus. Yeah, forcing melee combat in my warrior brood. Not a good idea. Keep on at it, guys. Keep on at it. You're doing great. Fan diddle tastic. Oh, Jesus came back. Reggie's a little bit pissed off. But I would be pissed off too. If I almost died to a couple of really, really weird alien creatures. However, it seems like I've lost a lot of my units. Don't worry though. Oh, that's all dead. Oh, where's the Trigon? Okay, there it is. Good. We need more Trigons. We need more Warrior Broods. We need more... Hormagons. Spygons. Fire upon that area. Send in the Trigon! Which is basically a giant fucking Megazord. Look at this thing, it's like a damn snake. Just in Tyranid form. Okay, focus fire to take that guy out. You take out the turret. Who do you think you are, huh? Coming in over here and trying to wreck havoc. I'll have you know, we are the Tyranids and we're here to stay. Oh yeah, we can spawn Revenor Alpha from the sky. How sick is that? Fucking Godzilla up in here. Where's my other Trigon? Ah, oh, he's moving forward, that's good. Come on, Trigons, we need you. Continue killing the sisters of battle. Emoliator tanks. Those guys are pretty good against infantry, but when you get zone throws, good god, everything just melts. Yep, there goes the sisters' battle. Gotta say, that was a pretty close one, especially when Jesus came in and tried to kill my units. Well, that's it. Holy crap, was that a pretty cool one. Look at all my units to show them about. This guy looks like a fucking alien. From AVP and then we have our giant snake creature over here. Oh, that looks beautiful. Anyway, my name is Astro Rolfus. I'll see you guys next time. And uh, I don't know what else to say besides thank you guys for voting for the factions. I guess in the next video we're going to be playing as the Ox. And then afterwards the fucking Space Elves. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.